loathe taking you away from your studies, young wizard, but a matter of utmost importance has arisen. Please come to visit me at the first opportunity. I have troubling news from Grizzleheim. It seems as if the cold day we feared has come to pass. Your old friend in Grizzleheim, Bjorn Ironclaws, sends word that the ravens of the coven have struck once again. Bjorn sent word to ask you to venture to Northgard in Grizzleheim and speak to him at once. Uh, your instructors are aware you may miss some class time. Uh, there may be make-up work when this matter is complete. Could you come at once to my office? Grizzleheim has need again of your assistance. As you know, the other faculty members and I are quite impressed with your performance here at Ravenwood School. So much so, that we would like you to travel abroad as a representative of the best Wizard City has to offer. You will compete in a magical tournament, dueling students from other magic schools for the ultimate prize, the Spiral Cup. Sadly, Ravenwood hasn't taken the cup in a long, long while, but we can't give up trying. Please report to Mr. Lincoln in Ravenwood. He can provide you with all the details. Have you gone to speak to Mr. Lincoln in Ravenwood? Time is precious. Do not waste it. Hello there, young wizard. I've been expecting you. The Ravenwood School of Magic must send a student wizard to participate in a spiral-wide tournament of magic. This tournament is a very prestigious event, a chance for students across the spiral to compete for their school's honor. The tournament is held at Pigswick Academy, a rival school to Ravenwood, located on the world of Wisteria. After reviewing all eligible students, Headmaster Ambrose and the other professors chose you to be our representative. You will need this ring to show that you're our champion, the student to defend Ravenwood's honor in the tournament. Mr. Lincoln hands you a heavy ring 
with an emblem of Bartleby inscribed upon it. Be sure to put that somewhere safe, mind you. Perhaps lock it away in a drawer. It's too precious to carry around loose. Now the spiral door will take you to Wisteria. When you get there, see the Pigswick Academy Registrar, Mrs. Dowager. She'll get you set up and see that you're taken care of. Good luck! What are you waiting for? You should go through the spiral door to Wisteria and speak to Mrs. Dowager. Off with you! Hello there. You must be our visiting wizard. Welcome to Pigswick Academy. I'll need to see your Ravenwood ring. Just a formality, of course. You show Mrs. Dowager the ring Mr. Lincoln gave you. She inspects it and hands it back. Excellent. Be sure to put that somewhere safe. You're here, of course, to build a sense of community between the different magic schools and to try to win the Spiral Cup. Go to the tournament hall to take a look at it. Then speak to Benedict Glendemming. He is both Master of Arms and our judge. You will probably need to demonstrate your skills in a qualifying match. So be on the ready. When you've passed the qualifying round, return to me and we'll get you sorted out. How exciting! You should get going. Speak to Benedict Glendemming in the tournament hall about qualifying for the tournament. Have a look at the Spiral Cup while you're there. You inspect the Spiral Cup, the greatest prize in all the Spiral. It looks like it's been here a while. Greetings, visitor. I am Benedict Clem Deming, Master of Arms of Pigsvik Academy. For years I have taught magic and dueling with my training. Pigsvik students have won the Spiral Cup again and again. I am also the judge of this fine competition. My decisions are as fair as they are final. You come from Wizard City, no? You have my sympathy. Let us see if that charlatan Diego has taught you anything of worth. To qualify for the tournament, you must step into the Chamber of the Basilisk, if you will, and defeat Blaze Flamerender. There is no shame in defeat, so do not feel too badly if you do not succeed. Perhaps next year, no? Watch out, wizard. Pigswick folk are cheaters. They'll break the rules whenever they can get away with it. Well, well, well. A wizard of Ravenwood, huh? I'll go easy on ya. 
Watch out, wizard. Pigswick folk are cheaters. They'll break the rules whenever they can get away with it. Go and tell Master Glen Dammit that you won the duel. I wasn't expecting much, but you certainly showed me a thing or two. So Diego has stepped up his game, no? Very well then. You will not be going home just yet. The tournament consists of four rounds of duels, each round against a rival school. You must win each duel to proceed. See Mrs. Dowager outside. She will see to your accommodations within the student dormitory. Good for you. It's been so long since a Ravenwood student competed. I was worried they'd given up teaching magic there. Now that we've determined you'll be staying to compete in the tournament, it's time to get you squared away. You should report to the student dormitory. There you can meet the students you will be matched against and introduce yourself. You'll be sharing quarters with Beatrice Wildwind, Kisai Shugenja, Nalia Doonstrider, and uh, Randolph Spellshine. You should also take the opportunity to put your Ravenwood class ring away. There's a small dresser. It should be safe there. <laughs> <laughs> 